Coming from Little Square Pond and onto Fish Creek, me and the canoe captain, Kenny, set no sails, but rather pushed and prodded the waters with our wooden paddles. I gazed off into the untraversable greenery and the old dead growth looked back with an eerie strength. While in my trance, Kenny reminds me that I should keep on paddling. Here's Kenny now. We floated past lush forest and watched the sun dance on the ripples that our paddles made with each stroke. It's such a fine feeling to be out here with a good friend. We came upon a fallen tree on Fish Creek, so we did our duty and helped clear the path. I have to say it's a mighty fine feeling to help yourself and the next canoeer when you can. We make camp and realize it's too windy to safely have a fire, so we gather fallen trees and make a simple wind barrier. The smoke from the fire protects us from the mosquitoes and frees us to work and shoot the breeze about our fears and dreams that wait for us when we return home. As the sun goes down, it becomes too hard to resist the smooth gradient waters and the beckoning call of the loon to join us in one last paddle before the day ends. <laughs>